I'm originally from Portsmouth, England. I've been in fantasy for three years now and this is my fourth calendar shoot. So for my shoot today, we're shooting again with Oscar. So it's my fourth time shooting with him, which is so much fun. It's nice to shoot with someone you've shot before with because then you feel a lot more comfortable and I know his pictures are always going to look great at the end. So even if you feel kind of awkward when you're shooting, you, you always know that the, the end uh, result is going to look awesome. My photo shoot today, I was wearing a red satin bra and little knickers. Uh, super cute, I love the red, I love the red lips and against my blonde hair I really think it looks really cute, kind of holiday-ish but I really love that. My favourite number in the show would have to be my pole number, that's my one number in the show that I get to do all by my own, it's just me and then Jamie singing. So that's fine because I can kind of do a little bit of what I want and kind of make myself look as, as good as I can and show off my tricks and my skills and stuff like that. For me, I'm not a big like main dinner person, but I love, love, love dessert. I love British chocolate. That's my little thing that I try and get wherever I can find it in Vegas. Uh, but if not, anything with chocolate. Chocolate cake, chocolate brownies, chocolate cookies. I love baking. I'm just, ah, love, love, love chocolate. So obviously being a showgirl, it does have its shelf life. You can't obviously do it until you're 100, even though I wish I could. So I think in the next, you know, 10, 15 years, I'd still like to stay within entertainment, whether it be on stage or off stage, maybe backstage helping out or, you know, with the tech side of things. It's kind of nice to still be involved with it if, even if you're not on stage in the forefront in front of the audience all the time. Three words to describe me, I would say would be, one is definitely, I'm a big animal lover. Um, I'm big into supporting animal charities, stuff like that. I have three adorable chihuahuas at home. So that's definitely one love of mine. The second would be, I am, maybe it's just because I'm getting older. I'm a lot more spontaneous now. I, you know, kind of want to lift life on the edge a little bit more and just go, you know, say yes to everything and then, you know, see where it takes me and see where I end up. The third, I would say British. That's a stretch, kind of, because I am, obviously I'm British. And, you know, I still like my British food and, you know, all my family's still listening and I love going home and visiting them. So that's definitely a big part of me. After a show, I like to go home and just totally take it down and relax. I like to run a big bubble bath, lots of bubbles and bath salts all thrown in there, have a nice glass of wine. And right now I'm really addicted to Netflix, so I'm usually there, hair up, Netflix, glass of wine, lots of bubbles, and that's my perfect evening after a show. Thank you for watching behind the scenes of the 2016 Fantasy After Dark calendar. Hope to see you in the audience soon.